Welcome back everyone to Neverwinter's Nights. This is the second chapter, the beginning of the second chapter. Let's go see what's in this chest. Ah, nothing important. Some gold. And this lady here. Hello, ma'am. Okay, you've been working. Uh, finally woke. Uh, yeah, I was, you know, I had to deal with a lot of BS in the past, so yeah. Uh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Miss, excuse me. Blah, blah, blah. Let's see. It's a pleasure to meet you. you gotta be civil, you know. These people, you, got, you have to be civil to these people. Yep, okay, that's nice. Basically giving you 411 there on the... What's... Oh, okay. Giving you the 411 that you have uh, relocated and such. And we got all these sorts of adventures. <gasps> oh. Please listen. I have some very important information. No, no, I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to Tommy. Please listen. I have some very important information for you. Fine. It's good to see you here in Port Last, my friend. If we are to have any luck in tracking down this strange cult behind the plague, oh my gosh! With your aid, I am sure. You know, I, that is one thing I do get annoyed with a lot of these NPCs that like chase you around just to say, "Hey, yeah, we need to talk." I do not know how much you have been told about Lord Nash's orders. I shall help you understand whatever I can. Uh, certainly. well, exactly. You know, of course, that Dester and and Fenthic. Yeah. associated with some manner of religious cult that was behind the wailing death in the city. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah. Back my mic up a little bit. Okay. Okay, and continue. We know so little about this cult, and it would be foolish in the extreme to suppose that simply because their activities in Neverwinter have been stopped, that they have been defeated. You know, maybe... Not ex straight up executing them, or say that the execution will be held in private or something. Lord Nasher commands that we track down the headquarters of this cult and discover their plans. Yeah. And stop them before another atrocity is committed. Okay, let's go to hop on to it. I, mean, I want to go talk to Tommy though, you know, because Tommy's awesome. Erin Gend, Lord Nash's spymaster, is here in Port Last to help us do this, and has brought reports of many strange activities throughout the Northern Lands. Oh, cool. It is possible that agents of the cult may be behind some of these activities. If so, we may be able to find them and discover where their base is located. Your aid in this will prove invaluable. Okay, uh, let's see. Well, let's see how she's feeling. Yeah. As I am sure you can well imagine. Yeah. Fenthic, my only love, dead at the hands of my lawful liege. His true murderers, however, lie invisibly beyond my reach. Yeah, it's called revenge. And, you know, sometimes doing revenge is a nice thing. In moderation, of course. I wish with such fervor that it frightens me to see those allies of Desta Pay, no, I, 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 to see Tia visit them with I don't like how justice. this guy is like reacting standing behind me okay I am a paladin Holy Tia, crap sworn to uphold good and justice yet somehow I cannot condemn Fenthic in my heart he meant only to do what he saw was his duty I'm okay sure. wow I got a lot of choices here uh 1 through 7 I don't have anything to say about it Uh, uh, let's see. Don't be too naive. Not everyone is caught up in their. Uh, I can't remember if this actually holds weight. Uh, uh, let's go with number three. I am kind of sorry that, you know, Ventric did get killed. I thank you. That yeah. is kind of you to say. My own loss seems insignificant, however, compared to Benthic's disgrace. Yeah. 
There's also, don't forget, there's a lot of people who uh, lost family members, loved ones, children, parents, grandparents, grandchildren, uncles, nieces, nephews, cousins. It should not be distracting you from your task. Oh, uh, no, trust me, I'm always, I, I come to actually distract him. Yeah. It is just that Benthic's fate could have been mine, or yours, or anyone's. Yeah. How do you know that the path you walk is the correct one? We never know. Trust me. We just choose a path and we walk down it. Wherever we land, that's where we land. I have never questioned my faith or my duty before. But neither did Benthic. Yeah. I fear doubt, and I am ashamed to admit it. Yeah, doubt is a powerful thing. Perhaps I am merely wallowing in my sorrow. Perhaps I know my path better than I think I do. But I am mm. no longer sure. Is no. it wrong for me to think such thoughts? No, uh, the problem is, is not everyone really knows the path they walk. Because you only can only see a few steps ahead of you. Best guess, you can always... You can guess what's ahead of you, but yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, yes. Yes, it is. Ah. Uh. Uh, yeah, she is being calm. Yeah. My training and instincts as a paladin tells me I am not being hard enough. Perhaps it is best if I put these thoughts out of my mind for now. Oh, crap. The safety of Neverwinter relies on your mission, and my duty regarding that is more than clear. Let us speak of that instead. Oh, well, no. Uh, I don't care. I want Tommy. Well, now, if it isn't you, glad I am to see you. Isn't the country wonderful this time of year? Yes, it so is, my friend. Better than the city with all that um, burning and dying, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pleasant to see you here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, half wings, da da da. Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, let's talk to this guy, don't we? Ale, friend. Ale. You were instrumental in ridding Neverwinter of the wailing death, I understand. Instrumental. I need to congratulate you on a job instrumental. Well done. I was like the only one doing anything. Like every leading character of every single RPG game. Because all the other art. Because all the other characters in the game are completely useless. You have shown yourself to be possessed of remarkable courage and resourcefulness. Yeah. That is fortuitous. Uh-huh. Both these qualities will be needed if you are to complete your mission. Okay. But that is not how we should begin. I am known as Aaron Gen. Okay. I have served our Lord Nasher for some time. Hopefully, I have similar use to you now. Okay. Uh, pleased to meet you. Indeed. I know who you are. Yeah. There are many who whisper your name right now. Awesome. It's my business to listen to them all. So do you get a headache? My place lies in the shadows. Okay. I have many eyes and ears throughout the northern lands. Yeah. And it, if only I had foreseen the actions of this cult. Yeah. Instead of recriminating myself for my failure, I must do what I can to repair the damage. That Erebeth has informed uh -huh. me of where you must search, yes? Uh -huh. Yeah. She has told you of how you may root out these fiends. Yeah. Unearthing the cult will not be a simple task. No, yeah, well. What few whispers I have collected. It will be relatively easy. To just need to go out there and wave a flag. This region. It is vital that the cult's exact location be found, and that we are certain any leads we discover are not attempts at deception. Erebeth will not be satisfied until we find at least two separate leads that point to the same locale. Okay. So that is your task. At least two leads. Eh, that should be easy. I do know of one possible lead for you. Oh, okay. There has been strange news regarding a series of caves that lie north of Port Last. Oh. Investigation may reveal the cult to be hidden there. Okay. If not, there are other avenues for you to investigate. Yeah. The city of Luskin to the north, Neverwinter Wood to the east, and the 
wildlands of the South Pole. I suggest, however, that looking into the caves first would still be your wisest choice. Tell me about these caves. The caves are in the hills to the north of Port Last, near the Green Griffin Inn. They have long been used by humanoid tribes of orcs, bugbears, and the like. And okay. They are usually a concern. Yeah. In recent months, however, I have received word that these various humanoid creatures have been raiding the roads south of Luska. Yeah. This would not be unusual, except that the creatures now seem very organized and, I hear, are being led by humans. Oh. I want to say it's the Luskin people. This leads me to believe the cult may be involved. That will be for you to determine. Okay. Just keep this in mind. No matter what you find there, Erebeth will wish two firm leads on the cult's location okay. before she will act. We cannot afford a mistake. <laughs> ah, excuse me. Mm. Have you a question for me? Then? Um. I like to get going now. Thank you. What's this chest? 18 gold. Okay. Is there anything else in this place? A chest right there in the middle of the room. Okay. Which has a pearl. Now, much like the uh, previous game, uh, uh, previous game, previous chapter, did you just go around the freaking desk and go to the cabinet? Thank you. You. Sign up for what? Uh, appointing mercenary guild, blah blah blah. Uh, I'll be going. Okay, well, let's go out and avoid a lot of these cra- Too many crickets. Most of these people here are crazy, okay? He's crazy. That one's less crazy. Uh, that one's crazy. I think she's crazy. She's crazy too. But she's not a follower. Let's get that guy here. Thank you. Poor Elias. Oh, for. Uh. Help, sir. Uh, wasn't my word. I have a very catchy sense. Neither am I. Uh, calm down. Tell me your problems. Need my paw. Uh, okay, I don't need your life story. Uh, monsters live around the hills, on our farm. Uh, okay. Can't find your mother. Okay. Thank you. Oh, uh, yeah. The other staple of RPG games. Everyone seems to run at you. Oh, here's where you can event if you t teleport in or die. Here we come in at. Oh, okay, what's this place here? That's the end. The dock house. Uh huh. Why is there always an evil cat around? I'm looking for. Ah, oh, okay. It's that way. Adam, out of my way. Don't make me glitch on you. Okay, well, let's go over here to this magical place area. Uh, because I am a member of the clockwork people. Hi, ma'am. How you doing? Welcome to the shop, as I like to say. Yeah. I am Eltura Subtil. Okay. The finer collection of wares you are not apt to find. Okay, well, let's see what you got. I see your merchandise. Uh, 
Yeah, sure, why not? Here you go. Thank you. Oh, what's this? A helmet to hide my pretty face. That could actually be very important. Uh, let's see. Uh huh. Weapons. Morning Star plus one, don't care. Oh my god, would someone stop messing with the freaking cat? Gee, many crickets. Uh, I don't think they sell the unlimited ones, do they? Fireball is actually a pretty nice spell. Well, let's uh, give me a moment when we go sell a lot of this crap. Okay, well, I just got done emptying out my inventory a bit. Yeah, let's go through here. Oh, this looks pretty. Uh, can you talk to me? Greetings. Okay, you're useless. Let me just go. A chest. I always have to check out chests. Oh, wait. This is one of those weird ones, isn't it? <clears throat> it's one of those weird ones where I have to do some weird task. Oh, crap. Yes, Tommy. You can deal with that. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Go. After this, I'm gonna head out into the wilds. Now, let's see. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm breaking into someone else's house, looting some of their crap. The question you should ask. As where does the other guy sleep? Because Ser seriously, uh, something to think about is there's only one bed in this place. That's, um, I think there are a couple. A plant that's, uh, it will be clicked on, which actually contains gold. That's awesome. Uh, uh, nope. That's just more horror dump stuff. And even more horror dump. Okay. Well, as uh, the Spy Master guy said, uh, we need to go to the North Road to, is it Green Griffin Inn? I don't actually remember if there's actually Griffin's egg actually in the game or not. I know there's dragons and you'll come across some, I think, in this chapter. Maybe the next chapter. Oh, uh, a sarcophagus outside. Okay, okay. Am I going to be attacked by a mummy? Uh, it's done. Nobody has a spell and visibility in it. Wow! They told me you had a fine face, but gosh, you're the hero of Neverwinter. That much is sure. I have a fine face, dude. I probably have gangrene all over my entire body. Uh. That, uh... What do you wish? Ah, uh, sure, why not? Yep, that's me. Uh... As far as I know, there is only one. Unless you count Minecraft, and there's two. Or any profile that I actually fill out with that, then there could be many. 
Oh, there's also a Twitch one and a Twitter one. Oh, it's, of course, the YouTube. Uh, uh, is on good effort. Yes, I was involved. Okay. Yes, I am working with her. Uh. Oh. Uh. Okay. Uh, thank you so much. I have family in the winter, okay. And he disappears. You know, I'm going to put this somewhere. Something about this ring I don't like. I can't remember if it was about the ring or not. I think no uh, Wait. Oh wait. Or is this the door over here? Oh the door's over here. And let's talk to you. Have you yet discovered any new information on the cult? Have you not been sleeping? Do you ask me that? The spy master put you up to this, didn't he? No. I see. I suppose my state is obvious enough. So yeah, yeah, yeah. After all that has happened with the plague and and Benthic. Yeah. I think a disturbing dream or two is not so surprising, wouldn't you agree? No, it's not surprising. Anyway, some, these dreams shall they shall pass in time. There are far more important matters to worry over than how I am sleeping. Uh Now you too has the word perhaps you are right. Yeah. I, I am and Oh my god. There's These are my dreams. Perhaps now you can understand why I have not wished to discuss them. Uh. I am frightened at what they may mean. Uh Obviously, it's something I don't know. I am not a trained psychiatrist. I haven't played one on TV. I have not played one in a video game yet. Uh, sure. That's kind. I do. Until then, however, let's return to the subject of your task. Uh, of course. Of uh, course. What you will of me, certainly. Uh, no. Okay. Now, yeah, I don't trust halflings, odd halflings that show up and spend 20 minutes talk, trying to talk to you and gives you a random ring. In a world of magic, no doubt. Just calling it a hunch. Timmy, did you fall down the well? No? Okay. That was the... Okay. That was like one of those weird things, uh... That I was find kind of fascinating. It's like the, all the references about Timmy falling down the well. Okay, there's that guy, so... I think I vaguely remember this one. Hello. I'd warn you to be careful of danger near these roads. Thank you. You look like you can handle yourself, but I just a little bit. Sorry. Yeah. Listen to old Gerald, then. Watch out. Uh, you're Gerald. Your son mentioned you. What do you mean? Uh, bit of a tail. Okay, I'm not surprised. But nowadays, honestly, how messed up stuff is. We had a cult that was gen generating a plague via prayers. I'm guessing. I don't know. 
Oh my gosh. Reality of fabric of reality is breaking every moment. Uh huh. Okay. Who is this guy? He's an orc mage. Other cutting sorts. Uh huh. Uh huh. Perhaps I could help. Uh. I'll look into it as soon as I can. What a delicious EXP! Oh, there's a chest. Tommy, would you be so chocolate, dear? <gasps> there's a dog. A bee. Okay, what's this over here? Something wrong with this chicken, huh? No? Okay. Yeah, what's over here? Absolutely jock. Yeah, let's see, how long am I recording for? Shave off about five, ten minutes. Shave off about ten minutes of BS in the beginning. Yeah, okay, I got plenty of time. The heck was that? Uh, I can't wait till I get to actually start playing some of the uh, modules for this. A couple of them are pretty cool. One of them actually has a pretty cool character. Uh, mostly because that character became. Uh, you were the one that made that noise, weren't you? You are a noisy SOB. No. <laughs> Okay, and there's some deer over here. That's nice. And a will take special pleasure and a wong. Well, I was gonna come over and say hi to the deer, but apparently that thing decided to say, "Nope, munchy munchy time." I am an elf. Do I not like have like night vision or some crap like that? Special abilities? No. No. Special attacks? Special abilities? No. Apparently, I don't. Hello, dear. <laughs> dear. You are funny. Yeah, deer are kind of funny in some ways because they'll just do stupid stuff. Like, run head straight into a car. No disregard, no fear, just... Oh, wow. A mysterious wolf that has attacked. I love this part. What exactly is a one? Was it just an oversized wolf? And I'm killing boars. Boars are actually pretty uh, dangerous creatures if you're not careful because they can. Was it uh, especially if they have the horns? Oh my gosh, they can gorge you pretty fearsome. I was watching a uh, documentary on a while back and evolving like some I can't remember what it was so it was something stupid <gasps> goblins your shall decorate my home. I don't know why you want goblin remains to decorate your home I didn't even notice you there stop shooting on my butt You. Obviously, you died. Okay. 
Now let's see. Uh, ha, 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 ha. At the beginning of every chapter, why is this like 20 hours of dialogue? Garbage. Sure, why not? That can be garbage. Now let's check up the top of this hill. I can there's probably a stand here. And Tommy oh wait, Tommy's automatically attacking. I'm automatically attacking half the time anyways. Okay. Oh, more garbage. I do believe this is their uh, home. Well in the next episode I will be uh going through this cave. Or the, all these caves if I can. But in the meantime, I'll, I'll be looting all the trash. Get you guys in the next episode. Funny noises. Oh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. And have a safe one out there. Oh, coffee. You'll soon be mine.